I'm Joel, and I play guitar, and we're talking about our new album. Shrine is a collection of songs that have to do with uh, memories and things that are really important to us. Shrine is 12 songs that have conflicting moods and patterns. It's like you're having a really good day, and then everything just goes to shit, and you feel terrible. But it's alright, I guess. The moment we got back from our uh, fall tour in 2014, uh, we uh, rented out a practice space. We kind of just sat in a room for three months, and did it, hammered it out. Pretty much practiced and met up every day, jammed, wrote, and uh, over time we just slowly made the album and we, we uh, pushed ourselves to get it done. Since we didn't have jobs or anything when we were writing it, we really could all work together on all the parts and everything, like all together all the time. And for three months straight, that's all we did was write, 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 write. Instead of like one person writing a song, it was really all of us working together to create uh, the album how it is now. Right, so eight, nine, 10, and then we do, so instead of doing 12, like how we do on the first time, you know how we do, uh, like we do two slow after A? Yeah. What we do is we do C, we do C 10 times, and we do a slow thing 11, or like once, so then we, it adds up to 11, so it's just like slightly different. You know what I'm saying? Well, makes it more interesting. It doesn't though, it just makes it wrong. It no, it doesn't, that's what we... The process this time was much different because we had the intention of writing an album when we started doing it. Uh, I feel like it was much more focused. We uh, set a date for ourselves when it would be done. Forced us to make decisions on things, not just dwell, you know? And then we went to the recording studio, Panda Studios, and recorded. In the recording process, we had more time. During it, we had two weeks as opposed to one week, so we could experiment more with different gear and sound and stuff like that. Yeah, just more time overall was a good thing. The thing with being at a studio anytime is that there's one person that's doing something and everybody else kind of has to find stuff to do. So I think we all kept pretty busy working on websites and designs and songs and you know just relaxing a little bit since we really worked hard for the last couple months on the album. I ate quesadillas every day of recording and I, I fucking regret it. The main difference between Shrine and Everything is Fine is I think Everything is Fine is way more upbeat. Shrine has, I think, more psychedelic sections, maybe more, more happy sections, more instrumental 
you know, passages. It goes through more emotions than everything is fine. We're a lot older than when we wrote Everything is Fine, and we know more things about it. Are we done? For me, this is the first time writing vocals and coming up with melodies and stuff, and it was just a lot, I don't know, I, it was the first time for me doing it. I really don't know what I'm doing, so. <laughs> I'm really into sports, like I like soccer. Yeah. Oh, that's pretty much all I wanted to say that I didn't say before. I uh, put a lot of a lot of my soul into the album. We were, we all worked really hard on it. I think that uh, you can you can hear it in the in the music. Being in this band's cool because we get to tour and go see everywhere in the country and. Canada and whatever like there's nothing that's stopping us from going out and having a good time Like no one I know from high school or anything like that is do you know fucking working at T-Mobile or something like who wants to work at T-Mobile like that is stupid Yeah. I think that's the thing, it's like we aren't gonna find like it.